Welcome to Ludic Science. In this video, I will show you this, the Whitworth Quick Return Mechanism. This is a type of mechanism that converts rotary motion into alternating sliding motion of this bar. And as the name implies, the movement in one of the directions is faster than the movement in the other direction. Let me turn it on to observe so as you can see the movement in the return cycle to the left is faster than the movement to the right Next time you need a PCB for your electronics project, consider using the professional services of JLC PCB. JLC PCB is the world leader in PCB fabrication. You can order online. You just need to register, upload your Gerber file, and wait a few days for your PCBs at an unbeatable price. Let me show you the construction. Here I have an electric motor. It is a low speed electric motor. It has a gearbox in order to reduce the revolutions per minute. And I have a pin here. And this pin moves with the motor and pushes the, the bar from one side to the other because this bar has a pivot here so it can move in this fashion and we have this other bar which is the bar that slides from one side to the other that follows the movement of the other and why the movement in one direction is faster than the other well if you see here when this pin moves in the bottom the distance, the travel distance required to turn the bar from one side to the other is less than the distance required in the up direction. And therefore, the bar moves slower in one direction than in the other. Let's turn it on to observe this effect. You can see here that the movement to the left requires less distance than the movement to the right. You have to travel all this distance and here much less distance. That's the reason that the movement in the forward direction goes slower than the movement to the left. This type of mechanism has several uses. One, for example, is in a shaping machine if you want to cut a piece of metal then you put a cutting tool here and your piece of metal in this side therefore the machine will cut in this direction and then returns to initiate another cutting cycle but you want the return cycle to be as fast as possible because that time is lost, you are not cutting in the return cycle, therefore the machine has to move faster and then more slowly in the cutting direction. Okay, that's all for today. I hope you liked this video. If that is the case, please visit my Patreon page. Thanks for coming to my channel and see you in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.